Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Factorio. In the last episode we started building our mall and we're going to continue building that today. So last time we got uh, pipes going, we got the different kinds of belts going that we have access to right now and we got all of the inserters going as well. So we need to get moving on other stuff and I'm thinking that assemblers and miners are going to be next in line. And I actually think, because if we look at what it takes to build, to make assemblers, uh, it takes steel, iron, electronic units, and assembling machines. And for miners, we just need iron plate, iron gears, and electronic circuits. So I think we'll stick the miners out here at the end because we don't need them going all the time really so we'll definitely stick miners out here whoops so there we have miners now do we have steel coming up anywhere i don't think we do yet no we do not but we could get it going up on this side here and maybe merge into the electronic gear or to the uh, iron gear wheels maybe um, we also need all the modules going we need the chemical stuff the oil stuff going we need electric furnaces which needs advanced circuits uh, we have some stuff going on down here fighters are getting big the fighters are getting big we need to get um, laser turrets set up soon, very soon. So, let's see, we have red circuits coming up here, I think. Yeah. So, I think what we'll do is we'll set up another line. But first, let's get these guys hooked up. So, that's pretty easy and there and we can get these guys going we give them some inserters as well of course so let's see there oops there and there and we need an output box there and there and we'll limit it to, i think we'll limit to four stacks and we need some power and some light there we go we are producing miners excellent so what else do we have we could do pumps as well accumulators might be nice hmm i think we want to get chests automated as well and all the train stuff and of course uh, poles maybe we should get poles going next I think that might be a good idea um, let's see so for poles we need copper plate steel plate and iron sticks don't really like iron sticks. What is what is? So let's continue our mall out here, and we can continue it here. Yes, something like that. And we will get iron sticks going. And we need iron sticks for the rails as well. Do we need them for lights? No, not anymore. We need them for train stops. So we need them for a few things. Well, let's see how many iron sticks do we make a second? Two iron sticks every half second. That means four every second. Um, and we need six every half second here, but Again, these are not going to be going all 
no time. The only thing is maybe the rails I want to have going quite a bit. And these things. So let's get set up four iron sticks. And get those going. So, so there we go. Some power and some light in an output, and we can get something else going on the other side of this uh, output which I think we will I think we'll get uh, stone going on the other side we have stone down here um, let's see we'll come up right actually it can come out come up right below it I think wrong two three that's right or uh, I don't know we'll figure it out um, one two three four that's not right that's right and this is wrong Three, four, one, two, three. I don't think this is right. We'll see. One, two, three. Something's wrong. We'll figure it out eventually. Never mind. Okay. Um, could you going up here? And then we need. this to come up that way you will go under uh, actually you'll go under one further I need it to come out only on one side so we'll do this I guess Move this over one, put that hook back in, and we'll set up a belt there, and there. All right, so we should have stone coming up there now. Yes, we do. And it's just going in on the opposite side of the iron sticks. All right. Then we need some steel and some copper plate coming up as well. Uh, copper plate we have right here. So let's get that going. Uh, we'll do like this. Copper plate going. And then we need some uh, steel, which we have right here. And can we get that going up there somewhere? I suppose we can. We have to, so we're gonna... Not looking promising. Uh, Just do like that. And then get steel hooked up. And then this can go underground. There's definitely something wrong here. 
we'll, we'll manage. We'll manage. Okay, so we have steel coming up here. And it's gonna turn and run right next to the iron. No. No. Oh, good. All right. Oh, wh where, where are you killing my stuff? Down there. We are out of ammo pretty much everywhere. That is not good. We're gonna have to go do something about that soon. Okay, so we have all that stuff, so we can set up the uh, electric pole production. And that's what we're going to do. So, for the electric poles, we need copper, we need steel, and we need iron these iron sticks. And let's see. Those and we'll do those. We need outputs for them. So let's do an output here in the chest and on the ground. There we go. That's that. And then we need another chest. We need an underground for this. We need some power. And there we go. Let's limit this to three stacks. Two stacks. And combat robotics is finished, so let's see what do we want to do next. Let's do the electric energy and distribution. Okay, so we have that going. Then we need um, assembling machines. And we need three factories for that. Uh, but we don't have stuff that we need for that over here. We should actually put it over here and just run the, yeah run the steel over like this like I said this is not a pretty bus but it's a bus or a mall uh, so that'll come over there and then we'll set up some assemblers for this I'm not actually sure if we need all this stuff but we can just tear it up again if we don't right right So we need regular assemblers, we need assembling machines 2s, and then we need assembling machine 3s. And I don't remember what goes into assembling machine 3s at all, except there's some kind of fluid. I'm guessing uh, a lubricant. So here we need uh, one here, one here, and one here, and then we need a Thing. Go up there. Uh, oh, electronic circuit. Oh, my bad. Uh, it needs to be uh, long-handed, and I think it needs to be too long-handed. All right. So they're being produced. Then we need steel. Which we can't get actually. We need to turn a bit. So let's do that. We need steel. We need electronic circuits. And we need iron gear wheels.
So those are producing. And then we need them to come out somewhere. So send them out over here. And I really don't care if it's not super duper uh, efficient because we don't need it to be going all the time. Let's do two stacks of those and that one can wait. All right. So we have that going. Then we need electronic fur uh, electric furnaces because we're going to switch to electric furnaces, I think. Or are we are we going to do steel furnaces? We don't need coal if we do electric. But we do need a lot of power. And speaking of power, we are just fine. Right. So we could also do trains. Trains would make a lot of sense over here. So let's do trains over here. And let's do rails. They need stone, steel, and uh, sticks. And we can do sticks and stones, and we can do steel. And then we need an output to we'll place over here. And this none we're not gonna limit whatsoever. And then we need to come up a little bit more. Then we need electronic circuits. Well which we don't have over here. This is maybe going to be the ugliest mall I've ever built, but that's okay. I can live with it not being particularly pretty right now. Um. Let's see, we need we need some engine units as well. Okay. It's okay. Let's see, we need those. We need those, and we need those, and we can get all of that with what we have here. Pretty much. Let's just run this underground, because then we can just go about like this and run this up. We need iron as well. So, but what we could do, and I'm going to do, is like this. And here we need steel as well, which we can get. Just. So we need steel. We need that, and we need that, and we need power. There, and then we need an output. We definitely need more underground belts, fairly certain. Just do 
don't know how many goes in a stack of these. Let's just do one stack for now. And we have this stuff that actually just needs these things. And let's do... Yeah, I'll put over here again. Let's do two stacks of that. Where are they killing our stuff now? Over here again. Oh, over there. We need to get the... Uh, what are they called? Laser turrets going. And we need them going now. Uh, so that is the next thing that we're going to look at. These just need the same thing. So, there, there. Limited. Two stacks. And that's fine for now. Okay. I'm not actually sure that we need this to come up any further. But, fine. Man, they're damaging stuff everywhere we are gonna need to take care of that let's see do we have the ability to make laser turrets we do we need steel batteries and elect electronic circuits we have do we have everything going out here yet we have hmm i thought we were making batteries and putting them on the bus. Maybe not. Oh no, we were just making them for the robots. So we need to get that done. So for now we are have progressed a bit on our let's say not so pretty bus bus or mall. Ugly is such a nasty world word, so let's let's just say not so pretty. And um, that's good. And in the next episode, we are going to continue on that. And the first thing that we're going to work on is getting batteries set up and also getting um, laser turrets set up because we definitely need them now. We have angered the biters to the to the extent that our machine gun turrets uh, no longer can cope so uh, we need laser turrets so thank you very much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and maybe subscribe and i'll see you next time